Why is Pluto no longer a planet? Well, in 2006, the International Astronomical Union, which is like the organization that decides these things, they decided that Pluto was no longer a planet. But first, we need to know the requirements for a celestial body to be classified as a planet. Number one, it must orbit the sun. Pluto satisfies this condition. Number two, it must have sufficient mass to be nearly round. Pluto's gravity is strong enough to have pulled it into a spherical shape, so it meets this criterion as well. The third is it must have cleared the neighborhood around its orbit. This is the criterion Pluto fails. It hasn't become gravitationally dominant in its orbital path as its neighborhood in the Kuiper Belt is filled with other objects of comparable size, like other dwarf planets. And so Pluto is the prototype for a new category of trans-Neptunian objects called Plutoids. The discovery of other large objects in the Kuiper Belt, such as Eris, which is more massive than Pluto, prompted the debate that led to the creation of the new definition of a planet. But, you know... There are also other dwarf planets in our solar system that are even smaller than Pluto. So maybe, one day, they'll decide that. Pluto should be a planet, again. For more content about celestial bodies, and in between, follow us here at Wondering the Cosmos. Tell us in the comments if you want Pluto to be a planet again.